We've seen this out of Sam already in Atlanta. This is the battle for fourth. Oh, oh no! Ah! Oh no! Oh, no, that is bad. Don't like it. That's Gus Rodeo is involved, and it looks like it's Burleson again. on the inside of Remy Garner, who's just a little... Oh, high side for the World Championship leader, and that's a dangerous, dangerous place to be crashing. Please get out of the circuit. Look at all these riders. Oh, oh goodness me. Goodness me. It's exactly what you don't want to see. Do you know what? I think he's seen that there's an incident, and he's actually gone left. He's gone right, sorry, instead of left. Nothing. What, oh, what could he do? Oh, my goodness is, me. Look at the motorcycles. It's ripped the front. Wheel. Get out front and then just start running those fast, consistent laps. Dominic Doyle outbreaks himself Ooh. going in. That's another big mistake from Dom Doyle. Oh, and he crashes. down in a big collision. That is big. Oh, oh man. Yeah. Unfortunately, they Gosh. couldn't see him. So a big That's collision. What? For by oh. Was treiben wir jetzt hier? Wie stellen wir uns auf? Da hinten, oh, da sehen wir es. Leck mich am Arm, hätte ich beinahe gesagt. Fürchterlicher Abflug hier. Pretty impressive, when you look at them compared to the MotoGP bikes, like I mentioned there at the beginning, but the Australian Superbikes, he set a new domestic Australian Superbike lap time around Phillip Island here yesterday. Oh, God. But uh, here's a wild card this weekend and a huge crash for Russo as we come through the fast right-handers. And that's actually just where we saw Andreazzo's bike go off as well. Straight. Oh, mit viel Geschwindigkeit kommt das Motorrad hier an, aber Gott sei Dank ohne Passagier wird kommt dran jetzt an Carlos Checa in der Zeiten oh, da legt er sich hin. Die Aprilia con äh, Vitali con äh, Del Bianco con äh, Capellini alle spalle dei primi poi il sorpasso di Michele Pirro pazzesca la dinamica su Andrea Mantovani rimane agganciato la moto i due finiscono a terra un rischio enorme per fortuna senza conseguenze per questi due piloti Pit lane will reopen at a pro oh there is a replay of the huge crash that uh, Loris Baz had that has seen the Super Bowl 3 suspended for the moment they've been cleaning things up it looked like fuel from a ruptured fuel tank might have been the main yes. nice move it's a parabolica oh Johnny Johnny Ray hits parabolica hard oh over the tire wall oh he's, he's alright he's ok thanks for Sehen wir noch einmal genau an derselben Stelle, wo er schon einmal hingeknallt ist vor einigen Jahren. Und da hat Aaron Slide alle Hände voll zu tun. Michael Leverty eher einer, der... Ja, da haut ihn hin! Und viel Glück hier für Stuart Easton. Nochmal Glück! Spektakulär klappt! Oh, il y a eu un gros gros crash en revanche! Avec trois pilotes, a priori impliqués au minimum. Au bout de la ligne droite des stands. Oh, il y a eu un strike. Oh là là! À grande vitesse. Que va-t-il se passer Je pense qu'ils vont peut-être terminer la course, mais là c'est quand même une grosse chute. Oh le pilote, oh, il pas percuté, mais là c'est une grosse, 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 grosse chute, malheureusement. Un peu. The belly oh, what a huge crash! That's one of the Yamahas. An unbelievably big That's crash. That's one of the Yamahas. It it's looks still like still cartwheeling. It's Tommy Dom Hill. Tommy Hill. Tommy. Tommy. Had too much power. Left under the tire. Colder than the right hand side. He shuts the, the throttle. He's gone out too far. And he flicks him over the top. Let's hope he's all right. Clearing off, oh, it was a big crash right the back. It's Axel Pons who goes down, bike in the middle of the track. Oh, oh and that's Magdi Meglio, uh, not Magdi Meglio, uh, who's replaced him. Oh, my goodness, this is going to be red flags. This is going to be red flag. We're going to get a restart. It was Axel Pons' his bike was down. You'll see it take part oh, at any moment. That was Pons, Pons went what, down. Cortese, Gino Rio was lucky to miss it, definitely. And it is off. Oh, it is Imamuddin who... Uh, 
hit the bike straight away and at the back Ituriaz the bikes were going yeah. Ah, eh, ha, preso ha preso la riga ci picchia che, che brutto volo, volo. Che, volo che brutto volo ragazzi mamma mia ah lì ha prestato veramente giù fortissimo attacking the rear of the italian bike and that was a big big crash for paul free on the second of the answer oh the knights That's Vart and Edward. Oh, there's Ferrell's been a big crush, like a crush there. Crush here. A huge crush there. That's number 60. That's Julian, Julian Simon. Simon. This is in turn two. Oh. Shows what an amazing job the air fence can do as Absolutely. well. Absolutely. Marks has come through as well. The Yamaha's oh, one three. Oh, two of them have gone down big time. Now 31. Jack. The mill stack in today's 125cc Grand Prix in Japan. Run of the mill. Until you watch his bike, that is. Truly horrifying stuff. This is Spaniard Sergio Gadia T-boned the rampant machine. Both bikes destroyed, and yet somehow both riders were able to walk away. It's been a humbling day for Honda. Boy, do they need the 93 Mark Marquez back on there, mate! What's happened here? Oh! Huge crash! Oh goodness! That is Franco Morbidelli's Yamaha. We're going to have a red flag. At least he knows he's oh, in place. Look at the speed. Watch Valentino what? Rossi here. Watch oh that. My oh goodness, my goodness, mate. Goodness. Valentino Rossi. This is on he board with Valentino. This is on board with Valentino. Watch this. This is going to be horrendous. At the right hand side. Oh my goodness, me. We can see and oh my goodness, can you believe it? We've had a collision on the warm up lap of race two. Yeah. If we can find out what happened, look. Oh, oh my word. So it's actually, oh, and look at that bike. Oh, did it hit Sebastian as it came back down? Oh, it's not the oh, oh, that's an enormous crash, an enormous crash for David Salom here in this session with four just over four minutes remaining to be a theme here at Phillip Island this weekend. This is 19-year-old Dutch rider Jasper Evemina through the hay shed. That is possibly one of the worst places to fall. On the run-up towards the hay shed, Jules Cluzel. The replay of the Chris McLaren incident Ooh. as he just gets out of shape. Very fortunate not to take out another rider there. And uh, fortunate. Oh, very oh my God. That's that a is huge. a big crush, crush. That is coming into the, the brakes and just the front goes. And uh, wow. Amazing scenes uh, here. Nicky Hayden goes down. And White band around the tyre on the softer tyre compared to the other riders. Casey Stoner even then had the softer of the rear tyres. It caught all these riders. That right hand side, that harder compound, as I said, that's arrived here this weekend. We haven't seen it since the beginning of the season and the same tie they ran here last year thank you sessions and we're going to get a replay of this one as he heads around turn 11 and turn 12 and that's the high side but it's just at such a high speed that uh both bike and rider being cut <laughs> and oh, he's oh, no! No, it goes down and but Newland won't know it yet well he might Albie wheeler oh. oh he's lost the front end he's come down pretty hard there alby yes and he's certainly uh, taken a fair sort of a é o Marcos não pode entrar. Rapaz, um... Esse tipo de tombo, ó, injetou, tá vendo? Esse, esse tipo de tombo quebra osso. Hein? Perdeu a fim em trouble, and then big contact behind by the looks of things for Pufa and Well Run. Alors, accélère, on met la moto sur l'angle à gauche, voilà. C'est l'arrière. Ah, ouais. euh, euh, arrière, euh, pas, assez, euh, pas assez en température, certainement. Voilà, pour que ça fasse comme ça, euh, c'est très rare aujourd'hui de voir des high side comme ça euh, en moto GP. Ilvan himself crashed on the first lap of race two last year. That's a monumental high side for. Yem est là qui est passé à la 16e place. Oula, avec une chute. Oh, une chute terrible, terrible, terrible. Robin Le Arms. Qui est allé percuter ensuite. Euh, il est conscient tout comme il est allé percuter le, le rail de sécurité. Oh, der hat sich hier reingedived et on a beide mitgenommen. Oh, et dann wird man vom motorrad getroffen. Unter die Now. Oh no! That's Giuliano. Giuliano goes up in flames. That could easily cause a red flag. Oh no. Really nasty high side for an injured man. 
Battery team. They almost won. Oh, oh, no. Huge, huge accident no, there. Oh, no. Max Neukirchner off the... Trying too hard on cold tyres, oh. knowing that he got a bad start in ninth oh, place. He's taken Murray. Baltista didn't get away well. Oh, there oh. he goes, and he has collected the championship leader. We talked about the possibility of a crash for the second race in succession. In practice three, and it came, Daryl, after uh, after doing a practice start at turn five. Yeah, and you can hear. Ein Einsider, wilder Einsider. Ein Einsider, möglicherweise hier. Oh, der ist ja heftig auf den Rücken gefallen. Dann möglicherweise berührt mit Karl Magritsch, aber ich bin mir noch nicht mal sicher. Turn corner. Runs it too wide in there. Oh dear, this is when it's bad. That corner hits the gravel. Uh, Honda, has he hit a drain or something here? He's not been able to pull the bike up. It's so wet. Oh. Batista here. Yeah. Big high side, snapped him right off. Unfortunately, Scotty was able to get up and walk away. Yeah, the race is coming the next six weeks. Big high side, he almost hangs onto it. Look at that. Smith on the inside, Takahashi couldn't avoid it. Yeah. As well as Ken and Safoglu on the Honda and Ducati mixing it. Thankfully, both riders okay, but uh, we were worried about them uh, before they came to arrest. Both staring at each other. One of the Grassini men has gone down, is it Takahashi? From the Superbikes. Now, the guys locked handlebars, Kirk McCarthy and Paul Free. They just came together on the main straight. That's what it looked like anyway. They locked handlebars. Beaucoup de position là. Et chute derrière. Oh, 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 au changement de feu. Ah on oui, revoit. Oh, oui, alors effectivement, euh, Afis Siarin, hein, il me semble. As they round the right hander, Rattle and Wimmer side by side, Roth behind them. Oh, and a terrible accident there as Reinhold Roth collides with a rider going much more slowly. Alex Creville in. Simone Corsi, who's got past Keenan oh. Sofwoglu. Oh, and that is Keenan Sofwoglu, isn't it? No, it's not. Max it's Max Neukirchner. Yeah, it win. This was the. Oh! Oh, oh, dear. Oh, my oh. God. Wow. Oh. Let's have a look through turn 13. Oh, wow. Oh. That is a huge high side. And Loris was one of many riders to crash. It started with Sylvain Ginsley approaching the hay shed. Look at him riding on the top of the motorcycle here. Got stuck on top of the bike. It's quite dangerous. That's actually a pretty, pretty high speed area there through that part of the track. And for him, in front. Oh, oh, and a huge moment, oh, down goes Takahashi, it was Luti who tried to hang on, but Takahashi's been brought... A super sport race, Jamie Hacking on the green, Kawasaki loses his bike and goes down, it's the 99 of Jeff May that can't avoid Hacking, taking a second look, amazing how high May is going to get launched, luckily this bike never comes down on May, both guys okay, the race was red flag, neither rider would restart the race... Fortunate mishap which uh, scared a lot of people here. This is horrific and you see behind the bike there his neck actually gets bent right around onto his chest. You see he's had a moment early, he's off the side of the bike here, he goes to the wall, he bails out because he knows it's going to be bad and look at his Ouch. head there. But some of the riders are questioning is it a Bridgestone related issue here? Tony Elias, and this is approaching MG Corner just over the, the hay shed, then Marco Melandri in the, exactly the same spot. His teammate Casey Stoner, watch this. Stoner goes down in the same place as Melandri. Didn't really get the bike. Well, we didn't realise how slow uh, Rapid Truck and Willow was going. And, and essentially, as Willow Rock wasn't doing anything wrong, but he was in the middle of the track, which really left uh, nowhere to go. As you can see, after the bank, Kenneth Savoyu turns around on the. That Disappointing. This is unusual. Caparossi going down on the right hand side of the tyre. Keep in mind. It's up now into eighth place, isn't it? Oh, and that's Simon gone down. Sofroglu gone down. 
all in. I think this was the move, right? It was into 11. It was turn 11. Wow. Wow. Oh, and the bike. Oh, that Ooh. is a horrific crash. Crash here. Ricky Cardus in an altercation with uh, Takaki Nakagami. Cardus unhurt in this incident, unbelievably. And just some minor damage. Minor. Up, of course, between Jim and Elder. We just saw the gap, and there goes Stoner. That's a huge high side from Casey Stoner. Stoner is out of the Italian Grand Prix, but he walks away from what is an amazing crash. He's so lucky to walk. An accident. This is at the top end of the circuit, coming out of Arabiata 2, fast section. And this was it. Look, Kenny Noyes was leaning on across the line. And Morales, him and the bike do cross the line, just not together. Oh my goodness. Alex De Angelis and Xavier Simeon. Simeon falls, and then watch the bike here, Daryl Beatty. It sits on the crankcase there and just rides itself right. You gotta remember these bikes still. To ride a preference, maybe even more. Oh, so that Melandry's down. Oh. How many times have we seen that? And you'll not be auctioning those leathers off, my oh. son. Trotzdem irgendwo kommen ein paar Tropfen runter. Uiuiui. Oh, wow, 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 wow. Oh no, it's just a huge high side. Oh, oh. and Kyrodine gets caught by the bike of Nicholas Ayer. Actually, but as Gavin said, oh, big crash for Jonas Volker. Oh, he obviously was working far too hard, too much gas, too early in the middle of the course. Corsi's running wide, Corsi loses it. Boom, oh. there you go. Uh, that could have been a lot worse. Absolutely, not nice for Corsi. Luca Grunwald lost control first. That wiped out Guevara and then Tanucci. Look at Grunwald's bike there. Thankfully, no more riders involved with three, all taken out at the very last corner. Watch the first of the bikes. He's run wide, loses it, wipes out Guevara. Thankfully. Done, though, by a violent crash earlier when 250cc Japanese rider Tato Sakaguchi collided with a bike on the track. Second. It's going to be interesting. And here comes Mark Marcus. Oh, and he's down taking he down Scott Redding as well. well that is... Scott Redding's down. Oh, Marcus. The third. Considering just so out of one into two. Oh, he's gone down as he's grabbed the front brakes there. He had a heap of momentum coming off a lap time of a 31. Out of grid 23 or worse, but massive accident here. This is Randy Krumenacker and one of a couple of falls we saw. Some grids uh, that we've had some fantastic. Oh, big one for Melandry. That is, and that's the black stealth machine. Look. Oh, oh no, no! Massive crash at Honda. That's Checker. That's Harlow's Checker, and he's down hard. That could be a red flag. I have a hunch it might be. Oh, yes, it no. is. No. Oh, my goodness me. That was Marco Melandri and Arbe. Yeah, Arbe had the bigger of the shot. Well, I'm just uh, down here now. Oh, massive moment for He's crushed. Oh, okay, Lorenzo, that's a huge one there. He was trying to get through, but Jay. Berta Monca. And this is Yuki Takahashi. What a day. Gucci suffered a broken. Careful. Ooh. Ooh, that's Mike DiMeglio going down. Oh, oh my goodness. Taking Schrotter and Demelio hit then by oh my goodness me.